Hello, VR addicts. Welcome to my channel. I am Paolo Triani, and today we're going to do a first impressions of O Shape, which is kind of a beat game that sort of teaches you to dance as well. You have to go through shapes and whatnot. And as you can see, I've already played some of it already, and uh, I'm all stiff. Ugh. But you know, that's just us men, we always get stiff. Anyway, my back is also knackered. Um, as well and you know I've been going through these shapes for quite some time now and like, like, as you can see I had to pause the game like that's what's about to go through one oh so anyway uh yeah let's uh let's jump in and see what this bad boy is all about <laughs> Okay, so what are these songs? Born to Win, blah, 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 blah. This is early access, is it? I didn't know that was early access. Okay, so it's early access, gentlemen. Calm down. And here's my hands. Have I got like full? Doesn't look it, no. Well, something's happening here though when I do this. Uh. first because I'm not much of a dancer. No tutorial, just chucks you straight in or am I just like a... Uh, oh shit, I'm supposed to be here. Slow mo. Oh, right, did I fail? Let's go again then. Be a jazz. How did I? My arms out fell. Come on. Well, 
but I actually managed to complete it. And you get a round of applause. Holy crap. I got 243, but I don't think that's much. I want it easy. Uh, play on medium. I'm going to go back to the menu and pick a different song because I don't think that song tickled me. Right. Let's get some groovy ass stuff going. We're going to try it on medium now. Oh, this feels a bit more... Uh, Yeah, this feels bad. Everything feels bad. On a sort of beat-ish song like this, everything is so much more better on a higher uh, level. Um, on low levels, it just doesn't feel... Oops. It's actually quite hard, but when you get the hang of it, you could actually, you'd be dancing here. So it would actually teach you to dance. I'm clearly not good at this. It just takes some practice, I'm guessing. Boom, boom, ba dum dum, ba dum dum. That's just, it is quite hard, it is quite hard. Let me go back to the menu and pick another song. See what it's like. The songs are not gripping me though. So I've got a on to win. That. I would have had to dive halfway across my play space. Uh, that song's a bit more bad. The songs like are probably the biggest letdown so far for this. I think for me, I don't know. But you know, songs can be very uh, <coughs> subjective, right? I don't know how it expects me to do that. I'm missing all that. And you knock it down. You're all set now to rock this town. You don't really need to play it low. Just get up and go. This is all your show. You should know I believe in you. Every race you run, you're my number one. Kick it up now and bring it. I don't know why we're all over here.
Oh, I think it was being really kind to me there. I just can't dance, guys. I can't know how to dance. It didn't even know how to dance. I don't know how to dance. Okay, right. Well, I can't dance to this thing anyway. Um, but I'm just going to give some impressions once the music's just off and all that. It is really good. I actually am starting to break a sweat a little bit from all the kind of moving my arms around. Because your arms, you don't work your arms as much unless you do boxing or some sort of martial arts maybe or tennis or a racket game of some sort. Um, most people kind of work their legs like with running and biking. So yeah, I just went out of breath there from talking. Uh, so yeah, anyway, like I think the graphics are pretty good. I think that the way it moves really good, you do feel like you could learn to dance and dancing is kind of important in a way because I don't, I don't like dancing. I've never really liked dancing too much, but a lot of people do like dancing. The majority of people like dancing. So if you're a young lad, you know, and you think, I don't like dancing, learn to dance a little bit. Buy this game, practice. I don't know, get Just Dance or something. And then you'll be pulling in tail like no man, you know, because you'll be able to bust those moves. <clears throat> that was kind of really camp, but that's okay. It's the 21st century. <laughs> so then like, you know, um, graphically it's okay. It plays okay. I'm just a bit kind of worried about the music. This song's not so bad though. Uh, Born to Die, it seemed to be kind of all right. Doesn't really have the pumpy kind of songs you get for Beat Saber and Synth Rider and all those other kind of beat games. This is kind of different because this is sort of more of a dance game. And I've not tried Dance Central or um, is it Dance Collider as well. So I'm not entirely sure what those are, are actually like. I would love to try Dance Central though. <clears throat> but as you can see, I'm not very good. And this is actually starting to steam up. That up already, Where you're coming from A long road and the money's gone All the games where you played your part from This is a certain amount of time that you got to do as well You should know I believe in you Every race you run You're my number one Kick it up now and bring it on This oh my God, so be your day Yeah, this song's probably the best song I've heard, uh, played so far. Now to rock this town You don't really need to play it low Just get up and go <laughs> This is all your show You should know I believe in you Every race you run You're my number one Kick it up now and bring it on This will be your day I think some over low. No, don't mess up. No. Nope. Oh. I can do it. I can do it. 131 as well. Oh God, that's terrible. All right, let's try another song. <laughs> oh my god, I'm breaking my back, guys. Let's uh, listen to the one that sounds like... Um, is it Street Hawk or the, uh, the, the helicopter one? I can't remember. Street Hawk. Missed that. <laughs> 
Oh, I think I'm already getting the hang of it, right? Oh, I've got 40 in the world there. So yeah, getting the hang of it. Oh, already, okay, so I think, look at the time. Uh, we can play another. Of course, I'm supposed to be standing there, am I? I'm standing all the way over here. I'm standing quite comfortably in my play space, so I don't know what's going on there, but there you go. All right, back to the menu. We're going to try another song. Don't know about that one. And they just lose somebody recently, K pop. Sorry to hear that. They wouldn't dance like this, though, would they? They'll be like... place there I was just oh I missed that one all right 62 oh well gentlemen like uh let's just get to the outro that song was pretty damn uh good actually I thought that was pretty good I'm, and I'm sorry to hear about the k-star uh k-pop uh, uh team person that uh, passed away recently or or something happened to her. I don't know what happened, but I did read something in the news. Um, so yeah, let's pop to the outro. And uh, well, I'm gonna play a little bit more just to get a little bit more understanding, but then in the outro, and then I can tell you a little bit more about it as well. So yeah, let's do that. So there's O-Shape, gentlemen and ladies. And uh, what can I say? Uh, like I said, it, it, in the game, when you, if you watch the first impressions, hopefully that part's still in there where I mentioned that. Um, it's an actual pretty decent game. Uh, it's very fun to play. It's free on uh, Five Port um, Infinity. Well, obviously Infinity is not free, but you know you get it part of Infinity. Um, so, and it's not very expensive game anyway. It's what about twelve pound or something? I can't remember exactly how much it was, but it's around about that price. And you can get that on Steam as well. Um, I think it's on Oculus. I'm not sure. Uh, this would be great if it was on. Uh, is it on Quest? I don't know, it'd be fantastic on Quest as well because you have to move around a bit as well. You don't just like do shapes and punch things and grab coins like your Mario. You have to jump across the side as well to do shapes as well, you know, and yeah, and it, it does get tiring after a while and, you know, maybe, you know, you can actually, you know, learn some dance moves or at least get into the rhythm of dancing a bit more uh, by playing this. And, you know, like some of us men like myself, well, I'm stubborn. I, I was heavy metal when I was younger, so all I had to do was just do this. 
And I was a great dancer. Absolutely great. I can do that. I'm, I'm absolutely an expert doing this. So, you know, like I've seen Metallica like three times or something. I've seen Megadeth. I've seen like, I've seen tons of ripping bands. I mean, I can't even remember half the people I've seen and it's been fantastic. Um, Cause I used to be kind of a metal and then I went alternative and now I'm kind of any genre that I kind of really enjoy. I just seem to just enjoy anything I listen to these days. Um, but the songs in this, mm, some of them were just not really gripping me at all. They seemed to be a bit bland, almost like they were royalty free because they just couldn't be asked to pay for one. Um, K-pop one was pretty damn good and uh, Born to Die was it I think it was called was the only two that I really liked that I played out of all of them and I played all of them off, off camera um, so they're the two that really kind of gripped me quite a bit the uh, the one that sounded like a, like a TV show kind of uh, was a bit kind of lame as well so like but then like you know the actual gameplay was actually pretty damn good and you don't play anything on easy because even like some of the I mean, Pistol Whip is pretty decent on easy, but Synth Riders, for instance, is a complete bore on easy. You can't play, and, and so is kind of a little bit like Beat Saber and, uh, you know, Audica is all right on easy. So some games are all right on easy, but some of the real big beaty kind of songs, and this included, you know, um, it, and even though this is not a real big beaty song, um, beaty game, it, it you know, you, Easy's just not really as fun, you know, you start pumping it up, don't come into this game and play it on easy and think, oh, this is crap and boring. Actually go to medium or something where it starts spinning up a little bit more and you're actually flailing your hands all over the place trying to get it right. It's a lot more fun. Um, so this game gets like 10 out of 10 for fun factor and, um, and, and, and gameplay, it's amazing. It gets a real poor rating for the music, it's just terrible and the graphics are fine. The graphics are perfectly sharp, they look great. I use the index in this particular case and obviously the index has a 1600p screen. It ran smooth, it looked great, it was fantastic and the controllers work brilliant and the great thing about the index controller, you can actually let go of them. So you could probably see me in some of the videos just, just letting go, um, which is quite hard for me to do because I'm quite a grippy person, you know. I like gripping something sometimes, you know. Um, so yeah, I, yeah, thumbs up, I think this is pretty good, yeah. But the problem is, is we've also got too many games like this, but have we got games that will teach you dancing? There's Dance Central, which is probably a king of a game. I haven't tried it, but I can't, so I can't compare it. But if you wanted to learn to dance maybe a little bit more or move around a lot more than just swinging your hands, you know, this is definitely the game for you. Um, like I said, if you're young and you're still trying to find a woman or you're, you go out clubbing and you just like to, sleep with as many women as you possibly can or something like that. I know this sounds a bit bad. And it's same, this goes for the women as well, um, if you're the other way around. So not just men. Um, you know, learning to dance is, is, is a pro when you're in a nightclub and you know how to dance better than everybody else in there because you've learned to dance, you know, or you know, you've practiced dancing and you can hold out from, you know, dancing. You don't just last one song or something like that. You're gonna impress someone. You're gonna impress a lot of people probably. So, you know, it's worth getting a go. I mean, like, you know, there's like flipping Jumeirah Choir or something like playing in our nightclub and everyone's doing the kind of like, yeah, you know, stuff like this. And there's me, because I'm a heavy metal. <laughs> Free Jumeirah Choir. <laughs> through, through every single kind of like techno song. <laughs> through every Bob Marley song. <laughs> I actually like Bob Marley as well. Bob Marley's obviously ace. Um, so yeah, 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 it's, it's worth just picking up for that as well because I mean, it's just, you know, you're bettering yourself. I always think bettering yourself is a great thing to do. So, you know, do that. It's a, I think overall it's pretty good. It could do with some better tracks though. Only downside, uh, so thumbs up from me. So yeah, if you like this video, please give me a like and also subscribe because it goes straight to the heart. Hit that bell button down there um, so you can get notified about more VR content like this. And also make a comment below. What do you think of this game, for instance? Um, what, what's your best beat game at the moment? Is it Pistol Whip? Is it Audica? Is it Beat Saber still? Is Beat Saber still king? You need to do all these four things as well if you want to get into the weekly competition to win a free VR game key, which is just random, by the way. Well, I, I tend to throw a list at somebody and say pick one, but you know, it is random. So good luck. And uh, yeah, I love you a long time. Ciao.